I started to experience some feelings of helplessness due to our current situation and I just had myself a good cry, found some... Found some funny things on the internet to cheer me up. We're going to put the link down there for you so that you too can watch. No. You just can't, can you? You just can't just stand somewhere. I'm here. All right, what's up everybody? We have a late, super, super late start today. I haven't even showered and wearing the same thing from yesterday, but first, what we're gonna do today is make a Filipino breakfast. Filipino breakfast, they're the best food for hangover. And that's what happened last night. So, with that being said, I'm gonna show you how to make a bang silog, which is milk fish, eggs, and garlic fried rice. Let's go. Oh, I don't know. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. I'm going to I like the light here. Let's add some more. Oh, yeah, I think that's better. All right, first, first thing we got to do is get the fish. This one we bought at the market yesterday. It's farm raised milk fish belly. This is actually the best part of the milk fish. And then we gotta get rice, which we already have rice ready. We're gonna garlic fried rice it. And then egg is so easy. But I'm gonna do it the traditional way. I just eat egg whites now, but I'm gonna make this one with the real egg. That's our ski. Tommy Hayes, Retrospect Tuesday at my spot tomorrow night. Let's do a live feed. Sure, yeah, why not? So the first thing you want to do is put an apron. First thing you want to cook is the rice, because the fried rice, you can actually just microwave it later after you cook the uh, fish and the eggs. Second thing you're going to do, milk fish, because the egg cooks really quick. We don't use lime. We use, zoom it on the calamansi. There you go. We use calamansi. This is way better. Then you can start off with butter, and then, Garlic. First thing we're gonna cook, garlic fried rice. You wanna throw butter in there. And then you put the garlic, minced garlic. Depending on how much rice you're trying to cook and how much garlic you wanna put. That's one person, two person, and extra for how much you wanna eat. That's what I said. Oh. Once again, I forgot to push record. <laughs> and this is your finished product right here. That is how you make the breakfast. Come see, look. Ang tagal naman yan. Luto na ba? Asa na ang pagain ko? Masarap. Later if we get hungry. I have we have Brussels sprouts and potatoes. So that was it. That's how you cook the bouncy log breakfast. The reason why I chose that today, because I'm hungover. And the belly of the fish, actually the fats, the good fats, and actually takes care of your hangover. Fried rice, egg, and good to go. On. I'm trying to get comfortable here. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to our channel. Today is day number six of the quarantine. Today was a rough day for me. I had some feelings of helplessness today due to our current situation. There's a lot right now that is out of our control and I just wanted to share with you that today was hard for me. 
so that if some of you are experiencing some of the same feelings, I want everyone to know that you're not alone in this. Basically, you know, I just had a good cry and got myself some good hugs from this guy right here. We found some funny stuff on the internet to make me feel better, which we're gonna post the link right here so you guys can have a good laugh as well in case you need it. Everything that we're feeling right now is totally normal. We're gonna get through this. Tomorrow's a new day, day number six. You were a bitch, and I'm ready for day number seven, so I'm gonna go to bed early tonight and get some good sleep. I just wanted to say hi, everybody, and tell everyone I hope you're all safe and healthy, and let's take care of one another. And please, if you aren't already doing so, just stay home. It might be hard, but it's gonna be worth it. I don't get to sleep, I have to edit. <laughs> No. You just can't, can you? You just can't just stand somewhere. I'm here. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> We're okay, guys. Alright, so I want to say from the last video about Best Buy, um, Iper comment, uh, made a comment below. He said Best Buy was closed. He is right, but he was wrong at the same time because it's open. It's a battle of who's right and who's wrong. It's closed because you can't go inside. Iper, you just wanted Hazel to admit that he's wrong sometimes, right? But it's open because you can buy something. <laughs> also, I wanted to ask everybody's help. We went to Best Buy because my roommate wants to buy an Xbox. We spent two, three hundred dollars. Actually, the last time we went to drink, the bartender's charges. $400, so that means we drank 200 each, plus we tipped out 200. Oh my god, yeah, so his, here we go. His name is Ellery Rosier. Go to his Facebook and tag him. Say, buy your Xbox already. That's it. He's upstairs. That's it for today. I don't, I don't need an Xbox. I ordered a set of Uno cards on Amazon. Okay, I'll yes, play so Uno exciting. By, myself. by the way, uh, I leave this here on the table so every time I sit here it says Seize every opportunity to grow. Oh, it's a gay. <laughs> <laughs> good night everybody, we'll see you tomorrow. Have a good night. Stay safe and healthy. If I got a dollar for every time you slam the door, I would be the richest girl alive. Alive. Angalin. Tanga. <laughs> Don't copy me, I'm like responding to you. <laughs> I said you, you get the first word. You said you get to me. Thank you. Thanks for sticking up for me. Like Literally, I was just doing <laughs> what you <laughs> asked. No, you're the robo. Hey, uh. How's that name? Shit, how's that name? How's that name? Cooking. Cooking. Nang Cooking. Cooking. Nang And if you were me, you would do the same Man, I really love to play And now that I won, then it's safe to say